Hello friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Dana and this is Dana Creates. Today I'm going to create a Christmas DIY from the dollar store. Literally everything that I have came from the dollar store. Super easy, we're gonna make a snow globe and it's going to be big and it's going to be great. So stick around, subscribe, and click on that little bell so that you can get notified of other Christmas DIYs coming up soon and also family vlogs as we go through the holidays. Let's go and I'll show you how to make it. All right, so these are the supplies that you're going to need from the dollar store. They have these cute little houses that you can get. I'm gonna change these up a little bit and you'll see here in just a minute. We're gonna put one or two of these houses into the snow globe. Then they have these cute little trees and we're gonna fit one or two, maybe even three or four in there depending on how much room is there. Then we're also going to need some chalk paint because we're going to paint these houses. Now I'm going to experiment between salt, Epsom salt, and sugar as our snow, but we can also use this fake snow fluff as well. Now the main component of this DIY are these bowls. These are just plastic bowls from the dollar store. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and spray paint these two houses along with this little wooden dowel that I found. He's going to go on top. I forgot about that little guy. So I've just got some chalky spray paint, but you could really use it any color that you wanted. I don't like the color of these houses from the dollar store, so I'm just going to make them plain white. I could make them black. We'll just see how it goes. as it gets. I'm going to experiment. We're going to try sugar first for our snow. Let's see what that looks like. I think we might need more. So here's the test. Look how cute. I actually kind of have some chunky sugar here. There's little balls and I think I actually kind of like that. So I want to kind of test out what trees are going to look good in here. I also have to fit the houses in. So maybe we just do, I don't know, two house, two trees, three trees. Let's see how cute and how it's showing you what it's gonna look like once we get the tree, the house is dry. Check it out. See how cute this is gonna be? Isn't that fun? So I think we need to decorate the top a little bit, which is why I kind of took that little wooden dowel and painted it. So then I found this little wreath in my supplies. I probably got this from the dollar store a couple of years ago. If I had my Christmas decorations out, I would add a little bit more to this, but I think once we get the little spindle on top, it won't need much more. So once the houses are dry, that's all that needs to go in there. All right, you guys, I added the houses and a little light set. It's battery operated and I tucked the battery pack right there behind the house and kind of tucked down into the sugar. But I think it turned out really cute. You could add a little texture with paint and stuff, which I might do on these houses, but I actually kind of like the look of some of the color kind of coming through. Kind of makes it look more antique and old, just like the houses are supposed to be looking. I really like how it turned out, but we gotta put a top on this snow globe. There's the top. I'm not gonna glue it down because we don't want to have to store it like this, right? We don't want to be set on this and we don't have the, want to have the sugar going everywhere. So we want to be able to take it apart eventually. So I'm not going to glue it down. So I don't even need to permanently attach those two because it's just going to sit on top of there. Just kind of makes it look like it is a little handle to take off the lid. you guys thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed this little craft video let me know in the comments down below if you end up making one of these so it cost me one, two three four five six dollars to make this not a bad DIY take care and come back for more guys bye